Uh, that does not sound good. Thanks for humoring me. This chassis was created solely to aid in your Firepowers? That's intense. Polymorph, I think. It's cool, it's like like stretchy arms and stuff. Uh, still working on making it not look goofy, but. You're inhuman. Yeah. So what's your name? Dante. Kamala. Hey, what happened? I broke my leg during the escape. Well, at least you made it out, right? My mom came back for me. Yeah, I made it out. And she was captured. Well, the Avengers are on the way here in a couple days, okay? They're gonna take back the prison and... Your mom's gonna be fine, A couple days? Me. Why isn't anyone listening to me? I overheard Dr. Pym. They're moving all the prisoners to a new location. Well... Uh, they'll find that, too. No, they won't. Your Avengers will be too late. Here, let me help no. you. No! Don't you get it? We're inhuman. No one cares about us. True. I've got to tell Bruce. We could do something. I've got to convince Bruce and Dr. Pym to go back to the prison. Roy, I need you to send one of your disposable chassis to the Camaro with a few supplies. And Roy, stealth. Will be key. Right away, Doctor. I'm gonna say it. It's, it's just genius. Hey, got a sec? Yeah, 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 what's up? Aim's moving the Inhumans to a more secure location. Soon. Okay. You've been talking to Dante? I'm sorry, who, who's Dante? One of our Inhuman survivors. We were able to get him out, but his mother is still inside. And our escape caused AIM to shore up security. Gotcha. Look, we have to help them. That's not a good idea. What? There's inhumans in there. I don't understand. Dante's we're, mom. We I can't just sit around and I do can't. nothing. We're not going to sit around and do nothing, okay? Roy just left with the energy cores. It means Tony's going to be here in less than a day. We need to wait. I don't understand. We have the Hulk. Mama. The Resistance has been trying to infiltrate that facility for months. Getting out was far easier than getting in, and we, we had help. From the ground, its walls are nearly impenetrable. You saw what we did back there. I could help. But it's too risky. You want to help? You don't There's understand. You're not inhuman. You're not ready. I'm sorry. We wait. Sorry, I can't just... I can't do nothing. Hey, Kamala. You still up this late? Yeah, I... was going to lie, but I'm going to the prison. They wouldn't be moving those prisoners if it wasn't for us. Respect. Right this way. Really? Just like that? I've got a good feeling about you. But you're gonna need this. It's not safe out there. Thanks, Theo.
Those inhumans need our help. If this works, then all's forgiven. I hope. I'll be back before Bruce even knows I was gone. supplies. They must have put this stuff here years ago. Okay, Kamala, this is the real deal. Just keep it together. Get to the cells. Free the inhumans. Eat the cake. Hmm. Cake. Big yellow door. Screams way into me. Get these open, and I'm in. Can we just pretend you never saw me?
Oh no, not now. Not again. Oh. The terms of our agreement were clear. We deliver a cure. You control the media. And we more than held up our end, but this cure of yours? Children being ripped away from their families? People missing? <laughs> Even my resources have their limits. The public needs answers. I'm giving you something better. The launch of the Adaptoids will be the perfect distraction. <clears throat> and after? Without proof that your cure works, words like terrorism are being bandied about in some of my circles. Oh, it will work, Senator. I have the utmost confidence in Dr. Rappuccini's abilities. How much of that was a lie? The effect of the gas is still only temporary. And without my formula to keep them alive, well, the gas... Kills them. This isn't working! That gas gave us the Adaptoid. My formula kept you alive. Now if I could isolate how it manifests within the Inhumans, I know I can reverse the effects. There are more opportunities here. We have enough powers harvested to build your army. It's time we cut our losses. Shut it down. Expose the circuitry. They still haven't replaced the admin codes I installed last year. Sloppy. <laughs> Adaptoids. I've only seen these things on paper. Tarleton's making an army in here. The 
clearing out the building. I was hoping for more of a fight. Monica's office. Knock, knock. Anyone home? There you are. You must be protecting something important. Nice digs. Now I know who's really running the show. Years of undercover work, and a kid from Jersey City brings me right to the heart of Ames' operation. Adaptoids are government-funded. Machines to replace soldiers. Those morons are paying for their own coup. Now there's a door that screams evil supervillain lab. Monica's lab, all right. Let's find out where they've got the girl. Where's the cell access panel? I should be able to call up the last log. What the hell are you thinking, kid? You should have stayed put. Of course. Okay. Where are you? Dark Jerogen. None of your so called cures ever work, Monica. You're provoking her powers. It's killing her. You're not even looking for a cure anymore. The formula keeps inhumans alive just long enough to copy their powers. It's just a cover for your twisted experiments. Stealing powers to create adaptoids. I have to find Kamala. All right. You look new. I don't suppose we can talk this out. I can't tell you how many times I wanted to punch your smug artificial faces. Huh. So much more satisfying than I imagined. Decontamination protocols. Great. I need to stop this gas. It's working. the gas under control.
Kamala would be in the main cell block. They're transferring the Inhumans. Hope I'm not too late. to moved most of them. Be here, Kamala. Please. Not you all left. Fine. I could do this all day. I need you. Carlton has an army of these things at his control. Bastards. <laughs> <laughs> 
here. But only one of us is making it out of here. Wasting. Gotta unlock the door. <sighs> Picking locks was so much less of a hassle. Terrace leads to the inhuman holding cells. Tiny Dancer doesn't have as much bite as Black Widow, does it? Took you long enough to figure it out. I thought you were the brains behind this operation. I am. It's nice to be appreciated. <laughs> so if you're running the show, what's the end game? She may have worked with Taskmaster, but I'm not stupid enough to fill in a blitz for you, Romanov. Okay, let me take a stab. You and George are using Inhumans for your death weapons. That regenerative formula keeps them alive just long enough for you to harvest their powers. That's part of it. But I have grander aspirations. Replacing the Avengers. Not everything is about you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
a way to shut it off. me enough problems and I'm not done yet where's the girl Monica huh. oh, so easy is that where are you taking the inhumans somewhere safe you can't have all my toys of course people are toys to you no not toys Bad guy, bingo. Are you twisting your mustache inside that suit? Mock me. But everything I've done has been for the future of humankind. Your prisoners are human too, Monica. You should know this better than most. I've heard that argument before. It always ends with people dying. Don't ever you. What's that supposed to mean? Keeping people in cages. I'm not going anywhere. Humans. Wouldn't you like to know? Damn it. You won't get off that easy. I've got a special guest here. Binder. She's coming with us. Anybody need a lift? Hey, have you seen a teenage girl? Brown hair about yay high? Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, in the, in the cells. Uh, she wouldn't come with us, though. Okay, just go. 
Kamala. Black Widow? What, what are you doing? Come on. Let's get out of here. Uh, I'm, I'm going home. Uh, to, to Jersey. Um, I don't know who I was kidding. I'm no hero. I don't know, I got a Quinjet full of people who would disagree with you. I couldn't control it. I... I keep passing out. I... I blew it. Hey... Mistakes are gonna happen. To be honest... Jersey wasn't my finest hour either. Any dancer? Look, kid. You're already a hero. The only one left to convince is yourself. Come on. Let's get the hell out of here. Are you okay? I'm sorry. I messed up. Mm. It's okay. Why don't you... Uh, why don't you get inside? Tiny dancer. <sighs> it's good to see you too, Bruce. So, how'd you like that daring rescue in the nick of time? You fishing for a compliment, Tony? Meet me on the command deck, all right? We have a short window to make our next move while AIM's still on the back foot. Right, right. Pleasantries later. Got it. Okay, Tony. We need to show the world what AIM's been up to. And I've got the perfect opportunity. The AIM experience in Manhattan. The media launch for Tarleton's new adaptoids. Every network will be there. I think it would be a perfect place for a few dozen missing inhumans to suddenly reappear. We have to be careful, though. AIM will bury the truth and kill any remaining prisoners rather than risk exposure. We'll need the location of their lab so we can lock it down. Good thing you captured Tarleton second in command. If someone can get her to slip, it'll be Bruce. He's already volunteered. Not bad, Tony. Head on down to the interrogation room. I'll let Bruce know he's on deck. Miss Romanoff, Dr. Pym would like a word with you at the war table at your earliest convenience. Greetings from the Ant Hill. Natasha, thanks for helping save the day back at Ames Prison, and for everything you did as Tiny Dancer. I wonder who our mysterious guardian angel was. Anytime, Hank. Sometimes dirty hands do the best work. True. And how the hell did you folks get the Chimera online, let alone airborne without Terrigen? The Chimera has the same standard engines as older helicarriers. It's kind of like a hybrid car. But, you know, cool. Something tells me this isn't just a thank you call, Doctor. Guilty as charged. We did a little digging in the data you sent me from the prison. AIM was able to successfully transport most of the Inhumans. I've tracked the ship, but we'll need someone to go in after it. We'll do whatever we can. Thanks. I've already uploaded some mission details to your war table. Pam out. Miss Romanoff, welcome back to the Chimera. I have intel on the potential aim defectors that you transmitted to me during your time as Tiny Dancer. I've marked a location on the war table that should be of interest to you. Thanks, Jarvis. It's good to have you handling mission details for me again. Just like old times, as they say. Enjoying the view? Not enough to distract me from what's waiting downstairs. But I think I'm ready. I guess I have to be. Okay, I'm gonna go prep the interrogation room for you. If you want to chat, I'm just a radio call away. Thanks, Nat. I just need to, you know, ponder some things for a bit. Yeah, well, don't ponder too much. Oh, 
this should be interesting. These two haven't spoken since the hearings. Think Bruce is up to it? He better be. Once we break up Tarleton's little party, he'll clean house. The AIM experience. So many better names. Look, we need the location of that lab. Hundreds of inhumans depend on it. So tiny dancer, huh? Let me guess, you would have gone with Rocket Man. Please, not even close. You're my candle in the wind. Show's about to start. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. The triumphant return of the Avengers. Imprisonment and torture. That's how AIM's gonna make the world a better place. Please. Ebola, smallpox, polio, all fatal, if not for the lab rats. And humans aren't sick, Monica. You're just harvesting their powers to make your little robots. <sighs> robots that possess complex AI. Capable of assessing the most effective application of their powers, all with minimal human casualty. Where's the lab, Monica? You can reverse engineer Terrigen, sure, but it'll be catastrophic and you know it. You were there on A-Day, and you know if we do it again, it's not gonna just endanger in humans, it's gonna endanger all of us. Last I checked, A-Day was your mess. <laughs> <sighs> Damn it. Gonna need a stronger table. I see some things haven't changed. Everything's just an experiment with you, isn't it? It is. Tarleton and humans. Me. Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice! I'm going in. We need to find that lab. Jarvis? Sensors detect aim forces incoming. Tarleton's come for his sidekick. Nat, Quinjet. You read my mind. Stay with me. All right. Hey, uh, just watch yourself out there. I will if you will. Kamala, let's go. We can't let AIM stop us from getting these Inhumans in front of the press. My guess, Georgie boy's on to us. I think you're right, Tony. There's a battalion of gunships on their way. Bruce, Cliff Green? Uh, just hold on. Just give me a sec, okay? They seem eager to secure Miss Rappuccini. Jarvis, keep an eye on our guest. She's the slippery one. Jarvis, door! <laughs> Jarvis, can you open this one? Sorry, sir. AIM is locking me out. Guess we do this the old-fashioned way. Well, this just escalated. Tell you what, you survived this. Maybe you could work for me. That would be awesome. Great. Focus on the angry robots. I'll bring down the flying hunk of metal. With pleasure. Bruce, how are we doing on getting pissed off? Whoa! That's more like it. Nat, aim him at the bad guys and get gone. Way ahead of you.
Tony, we need air support. Get up here now. Be right there. Jarvis, drop the cannon. Charlton's got to be heading your way soon. Make your way to the control room, kid. Punch anything that gets near those energy cores. You got it. Please do hurry. robots, but we might need some backup here soon. Pick up as many as you can. <laughs> Heavy damage to my sensors and lower level systems. Please, Miss Carr. Hurry! Oh, hang on! Okay, where's the party? Three o'clock. Got him. Cover me. Where'd you leave the kid? The kid is in the control room, kicking angry yellow butt. How are you old folks doing? Ah, <laughs> nice. Getting the hang of this witty banter thing, Kamala. Dude, it's not gonna work. Oh, you're so naive. Shut up! You and your friends will let you down. That's all they know. Unlike you, I have faith in Bruce and the others. So did I. Once. The world's about to be reminded who the Avengers really are. What are you talking about? Has escaped. In trouble, Kamala! I need you on the deck now! I'm coming! Monica, she's escaping. We're here live at the AIM Experience in Manhattan, witnessing the return of the Avengers, but they... they appear to be attacking the city! Keep rolling! Keep rolling! Is it any coincidence? 
coincidence that this attack comes on the very day that AIM is supposed to unveil their promising new adaptoid program! Oh, shit. Oh. You're welcome. Thank you. You should know. I'm not in the best of mood. Wait, is that Thor? Where did you come from? I was serving the comet when it started raining bolts of metal from the skies. It is unbelievably good to see you. A bit dramatic, don't you think? It doesn't matter. He's here now. Hello. Just like old times. It seems he missed me as well. Aim dropships inbound. I see them. Focus on those mechs. Kamala, you okay? Yep. No. On my way. Hulk, you got this? Something Charlton cooked up to crash the Chimera. Fun, aren't they? Aim forces are targeting the engine room. Get down there, Tony. Kids, come with me. On it. Can you hold it up with wind? Or tear the ship apart!
navigation's ours, but the engines are still dead. Glass half full, Nat. Might want to hurry this up, Thor. Good night, folks. Thor, update on those mechs. We're losing power fast. They're sturdy. I'll give them that. Wait a minute. That's Carlton's endgame. We're the terrorists in this AIM experience story. Not on my watch. The Chimera can't go down. Not again. Spotted some drones heading for the command deck. Got my hands full, kid. I'm on them. Boys learned some new tricks since you've been gone. Security subsystems just came back online. It's working. Can you enable lockdown? Already working on it. Former colleague is an eavesdropping, okay? No, no, go ahead. I'm enjoying this immensely. Just out of practice. Tony, cool it! Uh, one last card to play, Avengers. I can handle the large one myself. You don't have to. That's the whole point. Much more of this. They did a lot of damage down in the engine room. Do not do this. Yeah. 
find this shield familiar, Stark. How original! You gonna steal my haircut? Kamala, Tony, we're trying to restart the engines, but there's not enough power. We're out of time, people. Brace for impact. Hey, God of Thunder. Stay behind me. Now, bring it. Completely lost your senses. Uh, prodigal son returns. You almost obliterated all of Manhattan. Well, holier than thou, where were you while the world went to hell? Coming to terms with my failings, not making new ones. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Everyone just take a breath. We planned on interrupting the AIM experience, showing the world what Carleton was up to. These adaptoids of his, they harvest their powers through the torture of these inhumans. They expose them to near lethal amounts of dark terrigen. Yeah, and that is only step one. Georgie boy is gearing up for a war. And what's worse is Kamala here has found some evidence that might show what really happened to Steve. Hi. Every hero has to start somewhere. You remember me? No. Show me this footage. Jarvis? You... Are you done? I have broken the encryption, so there is more to see. George! We have to shut down the reactor! It's pulling us towards that heat signature. I'm trying, but there's no way to disengage the crystal. Then get out. And seal the door. What? George! Go! No. This can't be right. Head to the command deck! What? Evacuate! No! No, 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 Cap. What are you doing? No, 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 no! Just stop. What are you doing? No. Cap smashed the reactor. He had to have a reason. What reason? Hundreds of people were infected. People died. Nat, Just take it easy. Don't you take some responsibility, Tony. Well, there's the Bruce I know. Throw everyone under the bus, why don't you? No, it's not the time. No, it's okay, Nat. See, he's been waiting to do this since Golden Acres, haven't you? Haven't you? This is our fault. All of ours. How do you not get that? Hey, what I get is that you actually believe all that crap you said at the hearing. I believe that we are dangerous. You really think the world is better without us? Yes. I'm out of here. You all have not changed. Look at her. She can't be fixed. She can't be cured. I've done the experiments. I've checked her DNA over and over and over again. You and I created the perfect disease. No, actually, I do the job. I make the tough decisions. Do it. I stand by the people who made me who I am. I am warning you. <laughs> Bruce? Make you angry? <laughs> See, it's always been your problem. Run from who you are, what you are. Maybe that's why Monica got the better of you. <laughs> Big guy, that banner is a coward. Guys, don't do this. This is exactly what Tarleton wants. I'd stay out of this one, kid.
guess that's it then. I'm alone. Not quite, Miss Khan. Jarvis? I assume you can keep this thing in the air? For quite some time, yes. Oh, that's a relief. <sighs> okay. Interrogation footage. There's gotta be a clue here somewhere. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. Come on, Monica, give me something. <laughs> Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice. Ugh, this is useless. I just want to talk to my dad. Calling Yusuf Khan. No, no, don't, Jarvis. I didn't mean to. Hello? Beta, is that you? Oh, come on, if you're there, I miss you so much. Look, I'm not angry. I just want you to come home. I'm sorry. I should never have told you to hide your powers. Perhaps you're scared, a little unsure. The important thing is that you always stay true to yourself. I love you, Beta. I love you more. Avengers, if you can hear me, I think I found a clue. Look, I know I messed up. I wanted to blame AIM so bad for what happened to me on A-Day, it blinded me. But Cap must have had a good reason for what he did. I, I know it. believe in the Avengers not just because of your cool powers but but because no matter how bad things get no matter how much you disagree you always come together don't you get it your differences are your greatest superpower I was just some weird kid from Jersey who didn't fit in. But you saw me for who I really was. You accepted me. There's still a bad guy out there who wants to hurt the world. But we can stop him. Good isn't a thing you are. It's a thing you do. shouldn't have said. I get it. <sighs> Altitude, dry eyes. 
I'm uh, not very good at. I'm sorry. So, same. Good enough. Yeah. So, you uh, found a clue? It, yeah, it, it's the interview. Listen. Scour the earth. You will not find our lab. Okay. Monica's right. The lab's not on Earth. I'm not following. Okay, when I was captured, Monica and Tarleton had this argument. Tarleton had to leave the room, and then Monica pulled up the coordinates to this satellite called Ambrosia. Ambrosia? That was a S.H.I.E.L.D. biomedical research project. AIM must have required it during the takeover. It would be a great place to hide proof of inhuman experiments, right? If you wanted to study in humans on the cellular level, then zero gravity would be a perfect place to do it. Good job. Okay, so we know where we need to go. We just need a way to get there. Project Starboost, sir. As I recall, you abandoned it because you couldn't generate enough acceleration in the auxiliary rockets. Yeah, yeah, no need to bore everyone with the details. That was before I had access to Mr. Shrinky. Jarvis, get Pim on the phone. We need a way to get up to this space lab. He's the only one who can help. Hey, Tony. Please tell me this is a social call. Yeah, it is. Uh, I'd like to socialize with a few of your Pim particles. You need to shrink down an accelerator. <sighs> well, then you'll need to break into a high security aim facility. Ever heard of Meridian? You're gonna have a hard time getting in. That place is no joke. Widow? I gotta say, you give a hell of a speech when you're pissed at us. <sighs> Look, Nat, we were idiots. I'm... As much as I love your squirming, it sounds like we've got work to do. I can get us to Meridian. Us? We're in this together, right? No time to lose. In all my time undercover inside AIM, I never could get the clearance to see Meridian. Well, Nat, you're about to get your chance. Uploading the coordinates to the hypercircuit station entrance. Let's move out. So, how many super secret research bases does AIM have? Too many. But Meridian is its most important one, besides New York. Tech on your suit? Hank's smart, but his PIM particles are unstable on their best day. If he can get it working, it might be just what we need. So, let's say, hoping for a miracle. You know I can still hear you, right? Ah, oh, crap, Nat. We did it again. Sorry. Changing channels.
guys. There's the hypercircuit station. It's protected by a force field. Destroy the field's power source and I'll hack into their system to call a train. Understood. There is a chest with special resources close to your location. That's not good. I don't like the sound of that. Running into some serious firewalls here. I need more time. On it. Just get us that train. Ready for you, but the whole place is on alert now. We'll deal. Choo choo! All aboard! Really, Tony? Security clearance accepted, Dr. Belova. Please board at your leisure. Belova? One of my old aliases. Damn it! AIM has been spotted near the anthill. We need that particle sample ASAP. We may be out of time, Hank. Not yet. We're almost there. Let's get what we came for. There's Meridian. Oh, crap. The AIM bees have been busy. I'm picking up a pin particle signature deeper in the base. I'm updating your HUD. That's why I love you, Jarvis. Uh, you guys are Damn it! I've 
Avengers, we have a problem. It looks like AIM has traced my hack of their systems. I'm getting reports of alerts on the anthill perimeter. I need you to find that particle sample and get back here ASAP. Even if we do find it, I don't know if we can get back to you in time. Hold on, I think I have a way to get you back. <laughs> She wrote, kids. Okay, I'm sending Theo, one of my operatives, through to your location. He'll teleport you and the particle sample back to the anthill. Teleport? Oh, this should be interesting. Please hurry before they reach us. Let's <laughs> go. 
Is it over? We have the particle dock. Hank! Damn it, Pim, where's your operative? He should be there. Avengers! Hurry! Where's the Pym particle? Get us back to the Ant Hill now. They need our help. You won't need it on the front lines. Hold tight. This might be a rough ride. Thank you. I'll deliver the particle to Dr. Pym. What is this place? Hey, resistance guy. Care to fill us in? Uh, this is a safe house close to the Ant Hill. Yeah, it doesn't seem safe to me. Let's get serious! Take that in! Why don't you guys take a break? machine will be through in a matter of minutes. Then let's take it out. Target the vents on its legs. Nice work. Now, go for its eye. Watch out. Coming back online. Side vents are overheating. Target them. chance. Focus on the eye. Side vents are vulnerable again.
Target the eye. Detecting a massive teleport signature. Ah, oh, damn it! Heck, evacuate the Ed Hill now. I don't think so. Hank, that doesn't look ready. Come on, Tony, live a little. Unbelievable! It worked. Congratulations, Dr. Pym. The Resistance has an impressive new weapon. It's sort of cute when they're small. Thanks, guys. I owe you one. Here. Thanks. I'm, uh, gonna need it. So what exactly is this Starboost thing? Meet me in the tech lab, kid, and see for yourself. Good luck, Tony. Thanks, Nat. Every test I did before ended badly. But with this new miniaturized accelerator, I have a shot. Because it is awesome. $1.4 billion vanity project. I may incinerate on takeoff, but I'll look damn good doing it. All systems are in the green, sir. But I must warn you, a large storm system has moved into your direct flight path. Never rains, but it pours. Well, we can't wait any longer. Tony, I loaded up some music to give you a little boost. Oh, no. Don't worry, it's not mine. You can do this. Thanks, kid. Okay. Three, two, one. Juice left in these repulsors. 
Hopefully this place isn't crawling with guards. Okay, let's see what we got. Wait a minute. Well, this doesn't make sense. Regenerative formula. That'll explain Tarleton's giant head. That's its source. Probably some unfortunate inhuman. Okay, let's find that door. No sweat. Rescue that inhuman. No more regen formula, no more adaptoids. High fives all around. Covered in space dust, this place does not get a lot of foot traffic. Unauthorized life form detected. Oh, hey, you mean me. That didn't wake up the Robo Guards. Not sure anything will. Most of the power in this place is being diverted to that single room. Crashing through their airlock didn't wake up the robot guard box. Maybe they're here to keep something in, not out. Bingo. That's not ominous at all. your fall. Then why aren't you letting go? I just... We thought... I mean, I thought that... It's good to have you back, Captain. I'm so confused. Yeah, come on. Gotta get you out of here. 
Wait, 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 wait. Tarleton. Did he survive? Tarleton? Who cares, what? The explosion, he was too close. He survived. Thanks to you, apparently. And Monica, if you believe the news stories. That doesn't make sense. <coughs> okay, I got you. The evacuation. All those people. Yeah, we'll get to that. You think you can walk? Yeah, it's okay. I'm good. Let's do this. Well, there's the cap I remember. Come on. Okay. What's the plan? Uh, well, we hide an escape pod and, uh, escape. You're winging this, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I am. Actually, didn't think I'd make it this far. Tony, where is everyone? Where's here? Oh, well, we're in space. My God. You weren't kidding. Nope. Wow, like riding a bike, I guess. It's down from here. You ready to jump? <sighs> Tony, what's... what's happening? Well, it's a long story. <sighs> How long was I? Ah, well, five years. <clears throat> Which, by your standards, is just a power nap. Starting to think people just prefer me on ice. See? <clears throat> You're already making jokes. But that's normal for you. Monica, long time no see. Can't imagine your buddy Tarleton was too thrilled about using superhero blood to replace superheroes. He leaves the details to me. Stop what you're doing. Now. Wait a minute. Georgie doesn't know about any of this. And he never will. Self-destruct sequence initiated. Uh-oh. I think we made her mad. Tony! I'm working on it! All right, got it. Let's go. What the hell? Oh, don't mind the killer robots. Hurry, get it open. I'm trying. For a dead guy, you're really pushing. I'm gonna have to brute force this thing. Why didn't you start with that? Thing is jam. Help me out here. Grab the other side. Almost got it. Tony, we got company. No time for a fight. Let's move. Watch out! Ah, damn it! That glass cap, it can't hold your weight!
shit! is we're not gonna die in a fiery ball of death. And the bad news? We'll uh, most likely suffocate first. <sighs> well, at least it's a good view. That it is. Damn it. So close. <sighs> well, since we're gonna die anyway, you have any, I don't know, last confessions? Your jokes. I just don't get them. I know, I read your diary. <laughs> Why'd you smash the reactor cap? A lot of people died. Tony, there was something buried deep beneath the bay. Somehow linked to the reactor, working its way to the surface every minute. It was the earthquake. I had to do something. The entire San Andreas Fault was about to blow. The ocean would have consumed the city. Millions would have died. I never doubted you for a second. Just had to hear it, you know? What the hell is that? Well, look who it is. Am I always going to save the day? I expect nothing less from the God of Thunder. Hi, Thor. Welcome back, Captain. formula. George? How long have I been your lab rat? I knew you'd react like this. You'd rather die than need something from them. I trusted you. You saved your life. You can control machines with your mind. Just think of you all the You infected me with his blood. It could have killed me. But it didn't. Remember the dream, George. How could you make me one of them? I made you strong. You stole my hope. And now... I am going to give you the same odds that I had. <laughs> I will rip the Earth of superpowers. Even if it has to end with me. They had you. This isn't on you. Tarleton didn't even know Monica had me. What? Ayde. The heist. Monica hired Taskmaster to steal a Terrigen crystal. His men triggered the security protocols, initiating the Chimera's autopilot. But, <sighs> but that thing in the bay. 
That was unexpected. The heat signal. It must have been what caused the earthquake that took down the city. What was that? I don't know. Nat, I... I just keep thinking. If I hadn't... All those people... No. This is not your fault. That ship was never supposed to be in the air. I would have done the same thing. You're alive. I knew it. I'm sorry. Um, come on. You should really see this. Thanks, Jarvis. It's good to be back. Since the Chimera's near crash into Manhattan, the situation has become dire. I fear AIM will use this as an opportunity to ramp up their persecution of all the Inhumans. We can't let that happen. The world needs the Avengers now more than ever. We are preparing for our final confrontation with AIM. I have completed my analysis of Mr. Stark's plans to equip the Avengers for this anticipated confrontation, and will need some special materials to complete them. Thanks, Jarvis. Time for us to get back and fighting forward. Let's see what we need. Excellent, sir. As part of the effort, we might want to help our allies. Commander Hill and Dr. Pym are both reporting serious difficulty in coordinating our efforts due to AIM's draconian control over world communication networks. How can we help? They have requested we destroy AIM's main communication hub to help unite the Resistance efforts. Let's oblige them, old friend. <laughs> 